Foliage set to peak later than usual. Some local businesses could be affected. Jack Wu with the 22 News Storm Team is live in the studio with when we can expect colors to peak and how that could influence tourism. Brian, by this time of the year, we're used to seeing most of the trees turn a yellowish orange, but many still have their green leaves. For businesses that rely on this changing of the seasons, all hope isn't lost just yet. Due to above average temperatures and rainfall, leaves are staying green for a little longer. Peak foliage could be delayed as much as late October to early November. Leaf peepers generate billions of dollars of revenue each year during the fall. Kathy Fiore from Magic Wings says the warmer temperatures might actually help her business. Regardless of whatever time of year it is, you're going to have a nice tropical visit. Although it is always nice to go outside then and see the beautiful leaves changing and all of that. So we're hoping it's actually just going to extend our um, season a little bit more. While fall foliage is peaking a little later than usual this year, there are still plenty of places you could see vibrant colors in the trees. Deerfield Historic District and Mohawk Trail are starting to see more colors in their leaves. Jesse Dean from the Franklin County Chamber of Commerce said the foliage isn't the only thing worth visiting. But I think what we see from the tourism perspective is that we have a, a large number of return visitors. So I think people just build this into the annual schedule and they're going to come visit Franklin County regardless of what's happening with our leaves. Dean also mentioned the many fall festivals like the Quab and Garlic Festival bring people from all around New England. It seems that business is still booming, but this trend of a late start to the fall foliage could continue as we start to see more rain and warmer temperatures each year. Working for you, I'm Jack Wu with the 22 News Storm Team.